Okay. Well, on today's ride, I'm in Guanajuato City, which is a haven for tourists, <laughs> but for good reason. It's a very, very pretty city. It's got these lovely hedges everywhere. I don't know how old they are. All clipped into a lovely box shape. <coughs> this is the uh, Mercado Hidalgo, which is impressive in itself. Look at that. Huge market. A bit touristy. Uh, and it, this is the most crazy city I have ever seen. I mean, if, you, if you want to get an idea of it, just have a look on Google Maps of Guanajuato. <laughs> and it is not a straight street. It's all like tiny little lanes. <laughs> so tiny, one of them's called the Lane of the Kiss because the balconies from one side to the other are so close that they say you can reach across and kiss someone on the other side. Uh, it is small, but what makes it even more crazy is that, and I think I'm going the right way, although it's a bit of a lottery, not only is it crazy above ground, but it's crazy underground as well, as we're about to find out, so I'm going down, it's slightly tricky, I don't know where this goes, Cobbledy cobbledy. With one hand. Yeah, so then I'm down in the catacombs. Oh, actually, this one's not too tunnely, but some of them you're just in, they're completely in the dark in a tunnel. And some are just sort of roads that are beneath street level, which is great because you avoid all the crowds and it's very touristy here. I oh, know, I think this is right. It's Silao, Leon. So this is the road I'm looking for. I'm going to see Jesus. There's a place with a lot of Latin Catholic countries. They do like a big Jesus Christ and there's one up on a, on a hill. Now I haven't suddenly developed an interest in the Saviour, but where there's a hill with a Jesus on it, there's normally a good climb. And this one looks like a cracker, although I think it's cobbled the whole way up. Uh, so we'll see. Yeah, so. I mean, it's such a pretty place, quite a so It's good for a few days. I don't think I could live here. Uh, it's also famous for Las Momias, the mummies. So <laughs> there's a museum of mummies here. And these mummies, apparently, I don't know if it's still there. But at one point, apparently, if the families didn't pay for the upkeep of their ancestral tombs, then they lost them and they got dug up and they ended up being stuck in a museum. I don't think I want to go and see a bunch of dead bodies in a museum, but apparently it is like a, it's the, the biggest attraction in Guanajuato. So I've got to head out of town. And I'm on the right road. It's also it's set in the hills, so it sort of creeps up the sides of the of the hills with these lovely sort of multicoloured houses. That's not the most colourful selection up there, but I've got a few photos on Facebook so you can see what it looks like. Anyway, so that's uh, Guanajuato, the mummies, the catacombs, and Jesus Christ. Uh -huh.